Now we are going to see the process of SOOT short a self organizing test model for P2P system. Here is the abstract of our process. In P2P system, the building trust relationship among P's can mitigate attacks of malicious P's. So that in that process, we have to propose and distributed algorithms that enable a P to evaluate trustworthiness of other P's based on past interactions and recommendations. So the, the trust evaluation is based on two methods. The first one is service and recommendation contest. It is defined to measure trustworthiness in providing services and giving recommendations. The interactions and recommendations are evaluated based on importance, recentness, and P satisfaction parameters. Additionally, recommended trustworthiness can be evaluated based on the recommended feedback about that service process. Here we have to calculate the quality of service based on post interactions and recommendations. So these parameters provide us a better assessment of trustworthiness calculation. And finally, good P's were able to form trust relationship in their proximity and isolate mole spin and achieve high security in oral file sharing process. Here is the DFT of our process. Here first move to one P selection process. In P selection process, we have to select the P for interaction process. The interaction process is taken place as two process, upload and download process. In upload process, the peer want to share a file to another peer. So after the interaction happen, we have to evaluate the quality of service and also the download process. In download process, if the peer wants to give a download request to another peer means, first of all, we have to verify that past interaction and recommendation from that service provider peer. If the past interaction and recommendations are successfully satisfied with that download request peer means, so the peer want to give a download request to that peer. Otherwise means we just give a request to that acquaintance list of that peer. So that the acquaintance peer give the recommendation successfully means so that the peer sent to the request to that service provider peer. So after the download process we have to evaluate the trust matrix of our process. After completing the interaction method we have to evaluate the service matrix recommendation and operation process. So the interaction is successfully happens happen means we have to evaluate the trust value of overall process of service recommendation and reputation so finally we have to evaluate the overall evaluation here the which peer has a high trust value means the peer is selected as a high efficient trusted peer so that the transaction is fully focused on that buyer peer so that we have to evaluate the trust model of that p2p system and achieve high security process here is the demo of our process. Here, peers are connected. We go to anyone peer for interaction. So, the backing database means the database are successfully connected. So, select anyone peer for upload process. So, the peer one starts new interaction. So, enter the access node for file sharing. P2 means so the uploading session starts from peer one to P2. So, choose any file for sharing process. So black kicking allocate process, the handover session short from P1 to P2, the file is successfully narrated to P2. So we have to run the P2 process. In P2, we have to run by clicking receive file means the file is received successfully. In P1, the file is sent. After receiving that file, so the P1 calculates the bandwidth, transmission time and P1 type after successfully complete the transaction. So by clicking acutant list, the acutant list updated for P1. Here the peer one starts new interaction. So the acutant list one is the P2. So then move to the upload or upload or download process. Then we have to upload another one file from P2 to P3. So the P3 is going to a service provider. So that we have to choose a same file. Any other file. So by clicking allocate means the handover session starts from P2 to P3. So by running P3.
So, by clicking receive file means the file is received successfully in P2 the file is sent. So, in P2 after complete the transaction we have to evaluate the bandwidth transition time and P1 type P2 type. So, we have to update the acquittance list means in P2 the acquittance list is P2 and P3. So, the file transaction completed in P2 and P3. Here, that moves to a download process. Here, the P's are connected, P can anyone, P4 interaction. So, here we have to select any one node for download process. Here, P1 moves to one downloaders, enter the access node for downloading process. So, then moves to the proceed means here we have to verify the acquittance list for P3. Here, P1 verifies the acquittance list is P2. So, the, the P3 does not make any interaction to P2. So, we have the P1 send the recommendation records to P2 about P3. So, by clicking P2, the transaction history is verified. So, the P1 to P2, the uh, transaction has happened successfully. So, the recommendation records sent to P2 about P3. So, that run P2. In P2, by clicking receive recommendation means, so the, recomm the P3 is selected. So, we have the P2 verifies the transaction history of P3. So the, the transaction is successfully done. So the P2 sent the acknowledgement to P1 about P3. The interaction is done. So by clicking send acknowledgement means so in P1 we have to click receive means the acknowledgement is received. So the P1 designs the P2 is successfully interacted with P3. So the P1 gives a download request to P3. So the P2 select a file, anyone file for sending a request. So the selected file is a attack in p.txt. So the P2 is a downloader. So the request is sent to P3. In P3 we have to run the same process. So by clicking receive means the requested file is so by clicking send means so the file is successfully sent to the P1 in P1 by clicking access means the file is successfully received so that in that process we have to update the P2 in P2 we have to give a service provider name for downloading process so in P2 verify the acquittance list of P3 so the P3 is in acquittance list of P2 so in this so the doesn't give the recommendation request to P1 after the uh, before that process we have to calculate the trust value of p1 after successfully complete the transaction so the trust values of p1 is evaluated here by kicking fag the padding effect of uh, the download transaction from p1 to p3 is calculated and also the competition value and also integrity billing and also the recommendation trackers by giving the recommendation process we have to calculate the value of that process RWA only recommendation weighted value, competition value and integrity value and reputation values are also calculated for that process. And in this process is uh, same for our in P2 in P2 so this is give the recommendation request to P3. So we directly select the file and give send request to P3 so because it is in the acquittance list the p2 select the any one node for and give send request to p3 so in p3 receive means the data is received by clicking send process means the p2 data is sent to p2 again access the file is received successfully then with this process is then we have to calculate the success value for that process transaction from p2 to p3 so we have to calculate the padding effect and competition value and integrity value so you have to here so the the values are the recommendation weighted value and recommendation competition value value and integrity values are also calculated and also the reputation values are also calculated for that process so then we have to move that process of p3 in p3 we have to give a name any service provider name for download request here we have to verify that p2 in the acquittance so that we also doesn't give a condition 
records. So by giving B1, the successful transaction will happen. So that in P3, select a file from that P2 process, then give us a send request to P2 means in P2 by clicking receive means the requested file is received so by clicking sending process means the file is sent to p3 so in p3 by clicking accept means the file is successfully received ok so after the so the transaction successfully completed means we have to verify the trusted values so the trust value is calculated for p the transaction between p2 and p3 ok and the competition will integrity believe and reputation competition and integrity believe then moves to the next process here we have to evaluate the overall service provider selection based on p1 p2 p3 values here we have to evaluate the overall trust value for p1 p2 p3 so the p1 trust value p2 trust value p3 so you have to evaluate the overall trust the p1 has the higher trust value so the corresponding graph is displayed for the trust value process here in that process we have to identify p1 has a high trust value so that the p1 has a best service provider so that choose p1 and select the process and choose very high security